Skip a barn on the deck here. Yeah? Steaming to Adelaw Shoal from Devon. You're a little bit behind here, yeah? so you're chasing the sun a bit. Kirk was late. Yeah, Brendan was late. The Hobbit was late. <laughs> For today, we go. go straight there. We've got a lot of lie back, but um, just see how many boats there are there already. And then we'll put some plastic, give it a couple of runs up and down the freeway there. Just from the north side and then on that outside line, just off the ledge. Yeah, so hopefully we'll get tight. Five kicks. Five kicks. We close by, Daddy. And we want to put plastic on now, eh? Yeah. Now put two Williamsons and if you've got a shallow runner, two shallows. Yeah, yeah. Nice. I like to say that's a long run. That's a long run for the way. Hey! Okay, Rick. Stay hot. Sorry, boy. It's not like he was coming around the back of a scrub. <laughs> Watch your fingers, Brendan. And make sure you take the elastics off the hooks. <laughs> Okay, let's put it on. Where's another rod, Ben? What happened there? Does he nearly left the condom on the hook there, Dad? So we just come around the, the top end of, of the shoal here. Still obviously quite early, so we're busy pulling some trawling lures around the northeast pinnacle here. And we've gone a little bit down the ledge towards a, a spot called Eelston's. What we're going to be doing now is uh, we're going to be switching to, to some live baits. We picked up some live baits earlier and we're going to pull them around the pinnacle and down the ledge and see if we can pick up something. There have been one or, one or two midwater showings, so hopefully that's, uh, that's in, indicating that there are some game fish in the area. Hopefully we can get one, entice one to bite. Best there, Dad! Getting pressed here, Gazi! So Byron's just been working a, a bucktail here. Yeah? I'm sure you can tell it. I was working a bucktail here. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> there's quite a lot of midwater showings here, yeah? so there's a lot of like between the 10 15 meter line. So we've been trawling down with the live bonnie out the back. So yeah, I've just been working it, throwing, throwing it up and letting it sink down as far as I can to the bottom and then working it through those through those showings. Bonnie. Yeah, Big bonnie. Looks like it had a longer body, but yeah. Yeah, he is. He's light, he's sleep through anything. <laughs> yeah, so you can see there, got him in the conda. We got a two ounce glow, it's a pearl with a glow of shot trees on the top. That's funny. Back in. There we go. Oh. We got, we got, on, on. Get, get, get. Take it, take it. Keep pressure, keep pressure. How's the line? Ooh, okay. Oh, you're joking. Fuck you, you bro. It's another one. It's true. It's true. telling you, is it? <laughs> Sorry, boys. Is I'm excited. New, is that a new species? <laughs> oh, no. no, man. So you can see that action that, uh, that Byron's working that bucktail whip. All loads right up in the tip there. Byron's on again with his whip stick here. Tell them what actually happened. <laughs> I was working this thing. Byron knows exactly how to work this thing properly because my action was probably not quite right. I've been working it for ages. Byron took it over. Two minutes on. Let's see if I can let's see if I can get it right. On, on, there we go, there we oh, go, on, on, yes. This is Braden Kane, on with the fish here. Talk to us here, cuz we're watching you here, we're watching you here, talk to us. You're worse than your buddy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, lovely fish boy. Well done, Braid. So it's on that bark me spoon. It's a red herring. Well done, Wakey. 
All right, let's release him. Just got chowed off here, dude. Oh, no, man. You gotta be kidding me, you just got chowed off here. The top, yeah. top shot's gone away again. No, oh, man, it's third time. So, it's the problem when you're fishing, when you're fishing light and finesse. You get the bite, but you drop a lot of fish. Um, usually with a kuto or wahoo, it gets caught between the teeth. And then he pulls away. Drags, drags through the teeth, so it, like you would take a ribbon and run ribbon over a knife, and the ribbon girls, it's the same thing that happened to the wife. On, on, break. 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 on again. <laughs> oh, there we go, Daddy. And that's what it's all about. What did you do there? Did you cast it out? Yeah. And how far did you let it drop? Uh, just not even lost, just like a meter down. Okay. That's it. That is a bonnie chocolate there. Okay, hold it upside down so it doesn't uh, shake. Front hook in. Back hook, you see two thirds down the bait. In. Three inch roll. Back in. Here we go, 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 here we go. Come on, that's a, that's a shed. That's a shed. Yo, where is that rod? That's down, that's down, it's down now. Him, man, man. Okay, it feels shocky. It's on the top there. Yeah. Oh. Could be a prodigal. Coming quite easy. So it's more like swinging on the top like a hammerhead. It's not bad. Yeah, a little bit too big to bite that. Oh wee! This live stream is a bit of a problem, man. Because yeah. now, I can't tune my missus, I'm stuck in traffic on the way back from the boat or anything like that. Or <laughs> yeah, true. Had motor problems or anything um, like that. You could always set something up. But I've never done that. I'm just no, saying, you know, like, but, yeah. for a friend. Yeah. You know no, but this is the people who do this. It's actually, what's the time now? Yeah. Oh, it's nine o'clock. Yeah, yeah, it's not actually it's nine o'clock, yeah. no? Yeah. 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 Did you, but you know what also, it's, for me it's beneficial because when I was blanking lots and I'd come go leave at 3 o'clock in the morning, come home with nothing, Julie start questioning where am I going? Yeah, yeah. And so if there's yeah. a camera rolling all the time, yeah. I'm alright. <laughs> <laughs> well, girls, your wives now I can blame it on Mary because um, Mary's got the car. Yeah. So oh, she's yeah. bringing... She's bringing the bucky with the winch. Yeah. So, so it's actually not our fault. Right. She's late. We've been wanting to get off the water for the last oh, two hours. I asked her to leave early. She never listens. You, have to, you can see I'm have to so bring, I, take the slip slop out again. You, <laughs> Go easy. This is a, there's, 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 this is an all, all age audience. Mary's, yeah, Mary's I, actually running classes actually. It's called a Swiss, Swiss Army Wife class. <laughs> Guys, it's, uh, a, it'll be the best five grand you've ever spent on your wife. Unrolled my wife. Yeah. You, your work. wife goes there for a weekend, <laughs> spends a weekend with Mary. Yeah. And Mary will show her how to make boat lunch, pack boat lunch, <clears throat> pack the car, tackle rods, hook up the boat, yeah. tow the boat, bring the trailer, put us in the water, go back with the trailer, bring mm -hmm. the trailer. Yeah. And pack the beers and how you actually and, and arrive with the with the cooler box of ice cold beers we can even tell you how to actually gift that so yeah you get a um you get a get better soon card <laughs> and uh you put that mary's uh classes voucher in there and um you just tell your wife you just say look i, I don't i know you're not sick but i just think you can get better <laughs> <laughs> Right. How yeah. can we help yeah, you yeah, yeah. to be um, better? Don't worry, love. I'll arrange my own accommodation for tonight. <laughs> is, it <possible? laughs> is it possible for us to stay in the water overnight? <laughs> we, um, How does it have a cabin on this boat? We love streaming. We love streaming from the Slonis Ski Boat Club. <laughs> Just moved into our new shelters, so yeah. we've got a we a nice place to stay now. <laughs> Roof over our head, lock up garage, security. The bar's only about 150 meters away. <laughs> Kirk will let you know tonight some, how comfortable some. they are. <laughs> yeah. What we're doing now is we're going to put a bonny on, uh, on uh, we've had it on the surface for a very long time. So we're going to downrig him. Yeah, so we're going to drop it, uh, ben, uh, Byron's downrigged it on 29 meters of water. And we've been seeing a lot of the show, showings at like 20. So um, we're going to drop it down to see if we can get, get it down to the 20 meter mark. And 
and see what it is that's lurking down there. Puffs on ya. <laughs> Big Daddy Kirk. You got a brown mole in ya. <laughs> Otherwise known as a shark fish. You never know until it gets to the boat. Yeah. It felt, like a, it felt like a woe to me, that's why I gave it to you. <laughs> yeah. I noticed how you quickly said, hey, who wants to do what I was going, oh. I'm a nice guy. As soon as you said shark, you yeah. went, yeah. go, go, do you want it? No, no, it's just, I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Honestly, I actually thought it was, I thought it was a woe. Just focusing hard not to fall in the water. <laughs> yeah. Here he is. He's got some long legs. Uh, oh. Off it goes. We go. right. We've got one live mouse left. Eh? The hook is the hook must be facing up that way, so it's offset. The offset must be facing towards his tail. Bonnie's over there and Bonnie's on ya. Um, just having a bit of fun with some Bonnie's, eh? Throwing a spoon and it's at the bow, but it's almost like shot for shot. Little biting spoon, okay? So this one can go back in. She's alive. Pussy. Jesus. She's alive. Oh, dear. Now all of a sudden it's up this thing. Once you start tuning when you're lying pausing. She's alive. <laughs> yeah, Brendan. Here we go. Oh. Chocolate. That's the one you want. Alright boys. Don't take our pies and vibes.